the road is closed. Oh my god. Let's see, I don't want to have to climb that again. So steep with all this luggage. La Línea today, the epic climb. Good morning, day two, traveling here in Colombia, Finca de las Alegrías, we are living from here. We are here at the Finca Puerto Alegre, here near Pijao, so we went for a coffee tour here yesterday, spent the night, and today towards Pijao, starting with a big climb to warm up the legs. This route will take us deep into the Andes Mountains. From Pijao, we will go to Genova and then Sevilla. The route is a total of 70 kilometers with 2,852 meters of elevation. Hi, Profe! <laughs> the teacher! Our guide! Just passed by. <laughs> he caught us in a taxi. <laughs> so today we're going from Finca Puerto Alegre near Pijao to Sevilla. But it's a lot of climbing. <laughs> and what you can see here is all coffee plantations. Looks like a forest of coffee. <laughs> so has a very characteristic flavor. My favorite so far. <laughs> I'm so tired. Already the beginning of the day with a climb. <laughs> We are here in Pijao, one of the colonial towns in the area. They say the time stands still here because everything looks like it was in the colonial time. You can see the structure of the houses. It's also well known for its great coffee places. We're trying to find a morning coffee now. We are here at a panaderia, a bakery for a second breakfast today because we already ran out of energy from uh, the climb this morning, so let's see. They have really nice things. Mm, my favorite, pan de bonos. The big climb starts. <laughs> it's just climbing most of the day, so it was good to have some uh, energy, energized with good breakfast. The road is closed from 8 to 3 because they are repairing, so we're trying to find a way to go around it. Oh my god, let's see, I don't want to have to climb that again. So steep with all this luggage. Federación Nacional de Cafeteros de Colombia.
Ah, oh, first out of three climbs. Oh, so steep. This over there is where we go in Henova. Really, we are in between mountains. Wow, the Andes. Lunch break, some crisp, so exhausted, oh my god. We are in Genova now, having some crisp at the local shop. Over there. I dropped my chain again. We are in the middle of the Cordillera de los Andes, you can see, we are surrounded by mountains and we were on that road, we had to go down to the village, from that road down to the village, then going up to the another village to cross the river and now up again towards Sevilla, so it's like up and up and down a bit. <laughs> That, uh, that cow or bull is looking at us. <laughs> so the monster climb of the trip is done. It's been all day climbing. The weather changed a lot uh, from like a rainforest now to pines and cloudy. So before we were boiling <laughs> hot and now just descending to Sevilla towards the Finca. If you want to support our channel, you can try Basalon Coffee in the link in the description. We cycle all the way to Colombia to bring it to you. In day three, we will explore Valle del Cauca, another department. We will go from Sevilla to Miravalles and then we will complete the loop back to Armenia. Good morning, day three. Today we are near Sevilla and this amazing sunrise in the Finca Olga near the town and now we're gonna do the last day, the last stage of the trip towards Miravalles and then back to Armenia. First stop of the day, Sevilla, not in Spain, Sevilla in Colombia. <laughs> Hola, buenos días. Uh, ¿Me dejas uh, one or two? Uh, un arepa, por favor. Mm, arepa for breakfast. Arepa, my favorite. Sevilla, in Colombia, not in Spain. Really nice also. Starting the day with a view like this, 
near Sevilla. Look at the mountains, you can see all the mountain range. Coffee. Yeah. Coffee with the views. Amazing. <laughs> We are uh, near Miravalles, we switched department already from Quindío to Valle del Cauca. The landscape changed a bit, now the soil is like more red and we are following a countryside road from Sevilla to Miravalles and then to Riberalda. Miravalles, now early morning snack. Early morning. Oh, late morning. <laughs> Let's see what we find. So, what's your favorite snack here in Colombia? Cheese bread. <laughs> de bonos. So, homemade ice cream here. <laughs> Perfect for this heat. Mm. Strawberry, I think. Mm. It's like milkshake. <laughs> We need energy for these Colombian climbs. <laughs> they are steep. We will have to wait for the truck to get out of the way. Same path. <laughs> Ooh. Going to La Linea, okay. I think. <laughs> I have the ensure it's gonna be a tough day, so. You see, I need some energy for today. <laughs> it's just going uphill for 45 kilometers, I don't know. <laughs> Coffee in the morning here in Salento again. <laughs> At all day climbing, I feel my legs from yesterday. <laughs> Here we go, up again. <laughs> we are going towards La Linea today, the epic climb. Never climbed so much in my life. <laughs> Maybe Transiberia. <laughs> 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 
eating some muffins for energy. I really need it. This part was closed because of the landslide there. I cannot believe we made it to La Línea from Salento. So we started in Salento at uh, 1,960 meters. Then we did 20 kilometers climb until La Línea at 3,378 meters of altitude. And now we're gonna continue a little bit down towards Toche. Oh, I'm so tired. <laughs> I was like, oh, I cannot do it. <laughs> but we made it, I'm happy. Made it to Alto de la Línea. That's a bucket list climb. We made it after La Línea to the palm tree heart. It's so windy here. Hola. So first long mountain bike descent, actually it was really fun, I really enjoyed it. I think I like more mountain bike descents than road. Let me know in the comments, are you a more a road biker or a mountain biker? Leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button below, it really helps to support the channel. Until the next adventure!